All right, guys. So, another little update. Uh, my wife, she um, had to be readmitted to the hospital. She had some uh, infection, and she also had signs of right heart failure, which we kind of knew because she was starting to retain a lot of fluid. So, it's just me and the girls today on Mother's Day, which really stinks. But we're gonna recelebrate Mother's Day when it's when she's here. So, there's my youngest. Of course, always gotta fix herself. This is. My oldest. Kenna? You wanna say hi to mama? So we're out here riding uh, her bike and walking and just enjoying the day even though we can't enjoy it with her, so. But there's something that I gotta show you guys. Uh, hopefully it'll be here in the next couple hours. I need to, it's down the road here. It's, it's at that cemetery. I don't know if I've ever posted anything from there, but they got the most comical signs. So, I'll do one for Father's Day, too, because I'm sure they'll have that same sign out there. It's pretty hilarious, so. Well, we're going to make our way around here and enjoy this this uh, day. I had no microphone on my camera, so hopefully it's um, semi-decent. I didn't plan on doing a video, but. So, one thing I did um, is I contacted Vertex. Uh, this is really nothing to do with anything just a just talking and uh they make uh edc backpacks uh you know it's actually the one i'm wearing now as you can see they're a little simple here and they uh i have a sling pack and it's good for just me you know carrying just a few little items and uh so now that i have to carry some medicine for my wife and for my daughter too uh Um, it's uh, e it'll be easier for me to use one of their other backpacks. This is a sling pack. I got it so I could ride a motorcycle and carry a firearm, you know, and sling it around if I needed to. Hence the name sling bag and uh, get access to my firearm. And I don't have to carry it on body, I can carry it off body, which I'm not a real I'm a big person on that, but anyway. It'd be real practical for me now, so I emailed him, asked him if there was anything they can do to help me out. Seeing as how I spent a lot of money with him, and you know, maybe they'll have to give me one to review, or maybe they'll give me like 50% off. So hopefully they will, and of course, as soon as they do, I'll uh, review it. I actually need to review this sling pack because it's actually a very good pack. I mean, it's expensive, but you pay for quality, and the quality's there. So. Anyway, enough of the backpacks. So we are going through, which kind of looks like a tunnel of trees through here. And uh, I just want to say a couple of things, you know, um, guys, for years, I, I would judge people quick, like if, if they were doing something silly, you know, like I can use me for an instance, perfect. You know, um, one thing that, I bought it was a snow blower and a lot of people I, I don't have a real big I mean I have a big house but I don't have a lot of land to clear and so I bought a snow blower and people were like I can't believe you know blah 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 you got a snow blower well you know the reason why I got a snow blower was there's two reasons first of all I have a daughter with cerebral palsy that cannot walk unless she's helped and I have a wife who is very hard headed and if I didn't move the snow she would try to go out and move it not only that, but she probably wouldn't now because of how advanced her disease is. But, uh, you know, I just need to be able to make sure the path is clear if I ever need to get to the emergency room or somebody need to get in, paramedics need to get in my house. So, you know, I was always quick to judge other people like, you know, oh, they're stupid for having that. Well, you know, there may be a, a reason why that is so. So, you know. So you may not always understand what like, people do, why they do things. For years, I would always, you know, not really judge people, but be like, why are they doing that? But, you know, now I've gotten older and I see why people do certain things. And some people do things just stupid all the time. They, they, that's just their nature. But, you know, anything I do anymore, it, it uses that as purpose. So, you know, I've always wanted a snowblower and I really needed one. 
and I got it. So, you know, it is what it is. So, you know, I'm just going to give some advice, you know, and maybe don't be so hard on somebody that gets something that maybe would make their life more productive or easier because I, I don't do that anymore. I mean, I used to. Fozzie, I'm sure you can you can vouch for that. I, I'd always ride your butt on all kinds of stuff, and uh, but I don't anymore. You know, I think I think we both know that I don't do that anymore. And my daughter, my youngest one, was behind us. There she comes. Kenna, you want to say hi? Huh? No. Okay. So she's trying to be old sneaky pants. And trying to get in here easy, trying to sneak up on us through the weeds. But she's not very sneaky, is she? Kind of, she's not a sneaky snake, is she? Huh? Are you ready? Put your umbrella back up because we're gonna go back out in the sun here in a second. All right, so I'm not quite sure if I even mentioned what was going on. So, my wife, um, they said she had right heart failure and uh they said that she had a real bad infection on the site i think i, I may have mentioned it but i'm gonna go ahead and mention it again and uh so they actually said that over this weekend it's mother's day today and that they plan on letting her go tuesday <clears throat> providing how tomorrow goes with the uh, antibiotics that she's going to be on to fight the infection so which is a good thing now what i'm going to show you is right up here and it's pretty crazy so I think it's pretty crazy. It's probably not to some people, but I'll show you here in a second. Alright, so we are here at the funeral. The graveside, I mean, not the funeral house. And uh, this is what is out here. Nothing says Happy Mother's Day than buying your mother a funeral plot. I'm just saying, guys, that's pretty crazy. So here it is again with the, uh, just without me in it. So I just wanted to show you. It's just, hmm. And you can plainly see that I am definitely in a, in a uh, cemetery. So, you know, people are dying to get in here, guys. So anyway, that's going to do it for this video, guys. So I just want to say, uh, you know, before you judge somebody's actions and what they're doing and why they're doing things, um, you know, just keep in mind that they may actually have a purpose what they're doing because far too often people are quick to say that's stupid why are they doing that? that's a dumbest thing but really maybe it's not maybe it, it has a purpose so guys uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here uh, hopefully my wife will be here in a couple days and uh, things are back to normal again I can get back to work and uh, I think we'll be just like it used to be guys so if you like what you see like and subscribe God bless guys Say a prayer for me and my wife, especially for her, and uh, we will see you guys in the next one. Have a great day, guys. God bless.